Approximately 48 million Americans have some degree of hearing loss. Cochlear implants allow some deaf people to hear sounds by overriding the innate hearing mechanisms of the ear. Some users may still experience hearing difficulties, especially in noisy environments or enjoying music. Contestants of the Cochlear Implant Hackathon strive to improve the implant's sound processing. Two Southeastern Industrial and Engineering Technology graduate students, Anthony Kalmies and Connor McGibbony, as well as Professor Sanichiro Yoshida, competed in the hackathon. The Southeastern team placed in the top four against 60 registered teams, which included prominent universities from all over the world, and received an honorable mention for exceeding gold standard performance in sound quality. I feel a little confident because our effort could add some value to the current technology. The idea that we could share an experience of listening to music again, and that was the most amazing thing to me because that's a real connection of science in the classroom to making it into the, the marketplace to improve people's lives. Connor knows more about music, and then I had experience in dealing with filtering in frequency domain. Anthony has a talent in guessing good parameters. Dr. Ishida approached me and asked if I would like to further my ability in MATLAB and understanding it, and I said, sure. The sound files they gave us, we did not understand what the words were at all. When we're testing these sounds, we have to listen and determine, is this a good quality? But sometimes when we're, when, when we're listening to sounds, there's very subtle differences and we have to use something called Fourier transform. What that does is it converts an audio signal to the frequency and then we can see all the little peaks in the sound. We tested by basically just repeat playings, altering settings, changing it up, inputting new sounds, and just testing it again until we got something legible. Then at a certain point, I thought we could understand uh, our uh, output sounds. Gore. Met. Jerk. Leave. Rag. Fit. new skills. I've learned some very interesting stuff I'm actually applying to my own work. This is basically uh, lots of physics involved and also engineering involved and medical science involved. Science is becoming increasingly more integrated and so what we have to do as future scientists or entrepreneurs or whatever is learn how to take different ideas from different scientific disciplines and put them together. And so this project was the essence of that. We're, we're taking wave dynamic physics, which has, which has applications across the board, and we're focusing in, focusing in on how we can make this device better. 